Rutgers, we were just talking to uh, Town of Hempstead Supervisor Anthony Centino, and now, as uh, Honorable Supervisor mentioned, like there is a there is a political process initiated, and uh, the community it has been invited and already participating in the political process in the Town of Hempstead. He mentioned one of his good friends, and also someone who has initiated the community into the political uh, forum. And we, I personally have been privileged to visit this person's office, Bobby Kumar. Bobby Kumar Kalodi, actually his name needs no mention. Um, in the community, everyone knows him. Yesterday even, we were at his office and there were like more than 300 people. Uh, that was part of his, uh, one, one of the commitments, like to bring more people, make them aware, especially that it was for the seniors. So Bobby ji, welcome to our show. Thank and you very much, Shanjit. Uh, uh, again, uh, my uh, best uh, regards to all your viewers. Thank and uh, uh, being uh, here today, in my very dear friend's uh, Rajesh's home. Uh, uh, my thanks to Rajesh and Rajesh family hosting an event uh, for the supervisor re-election. Uh, you know, i seen in politics so many candidates comes and go. I had helped so many people to be elected, but I never, ever, and I'm not just simply making this statement. This statement is as factual, as honest as I can say, a candidate or a political activist or a political elected official who said, I am running for public office as a public servant. Tony Santino is one of those people I met almost 25 years ago while he was a councilman. He is a true, true public servant, a true friend, a friend to the community. He is just a, one of the family member of the Indian community or Asian community or a community at large. He take his job very seriously. He serve the people with pride. And I'm the first one who always ready to criticize when somebody is not doing the job. In the same time, I take privilege along with our community to say thank you to Tony Santino. I only have one complaint about him. And that is, people usually work three hours, four hours, eight hours a day. Since he's elected supervisor, I think he's working 16, 18, or 19 hours a day. I want him to take a little break at least uh, uh, in a day to have a rest so he can serve this community that he loved a much more longer as a healthy, healthy public servant. Uh, it's not only I know Tony Sandino, I know, uh, knew his father uh, who had served in the United States Army. One of the wonderful family uh, I always say, uh, not only supervisor, is a friend of mine, I say a brother from another mother. Uh, again, I cannot say enough nice things about the supervisor. When he gave you a word, he keep his word, which is very rare in a politics when elected officials commit something and keep the commitment. As long as it's legal, honest, and moral, within the law, one thing you can be very sure, the supervisor of Town of Hempstead, if he gave you the commitment, he will keep his commitment, he will serve the public beyond what is expected. It's very rare to have a leader in one of the largest towns is bigger than four states if it was a state. And the budget is almost a half billion dollars. And this town is a, have multinationals. Everybody is welcomed. You can see the beautiful parks. And he wants to maintain, and along with his board members, council members. So my very humble request, just like the way my friend Rajesh has welcomed everybody and the supervisor and being active. It's important 
people to remain active so your voice can be heard. If you don't register to vote and you don't vote, your voice have no value. Your voice can be heard only one way, and that is you register and vote come out on election day and vote for the team of Tony Santino, who leading the ticket as a supervisor for Town of Hampstead. And I thank you. All your viewers, they are very educated viewers, very influential viewers who are hardworking people. And the reason for all of us to come to this country and especially choose to live in this beautiful town is because the quality of life, the safety of the people, and well-being. And again, uh, I cannot stop saying enough nice things about my brother from another mother or one of the best town supervisor. And uh, uh, I'm just proud of him. And I'm equally proud of the people who are supporting. Uh, Riesh is, even though he's a new immigrant, but one of the nicest people I met in my political life. And I asked him, uh, he said, Bobby, if you say he's that kind of person, we want to keep that kind of person. We want to keep the supervisor in the office. And, uh, and that's how he opened his ho beautiful house, gorgeous house, to, today to uh, do the function for the town supervisor. Thank you, Rajeshji. Thank you, Babiji. And it was such a wonderful thing to have everyone here. And um, thank you, viewers. Thank you for watching. Keep on watching Josh India TV. Thank you.